based around your the jacket is not you happy. Jacket. Oh, it does look yeah. terrible there. Just pull it down the back. Like you do. You have to do the exactly. There you go. There you go. I, that's what I'm saying. You know, my dress is just not cooperating. Maybe I'm one button, the top button too. Are we rolling? Go. Oh, go. Okay. Well, let's start out with um, this movie has a lot of political issues. Um, was that a big factor in making in making this movie for you? Um, in fact, it wasn't the 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 primary focus uh, actually, and um, although including it and, and coming at it from that perspective was became more important because it presented very valid questions and issues within our bigger question, which is whether women should be in combat or not, and. Um, uh, because in in the beginning, you know, Anne Bancroft's character was always there, and it was mm -hmm. always a woman, but she didn't have a, a turnaround as she does in this film. You know what I've surprised me um, in this movie is the fact that it doesn't seem like it's not really the issue is not presented as a one-sided or any. Mm. It's just really just there. Did you work hard to do that? Was this something you wanted to do? Definitely. Um, one, because you then slide over into something that becomes preachy. And, you know, the heart of this is, is the connection with an individual and her own um, struggle, her own desires, and, again, that are based in, in fact. You know, to move yourself up to a different grade does require um, operational experience. And so, um, the, uh, the, what, all of that surrounding it w was definitely uh, a priority. It became very important. You work, I assume you work, it just seems like you work very hard at every role, extremely hard. You can see it um, at every role you do. Was this one of your most challenging uh, preparation for this? Was this mo one of the more challenging ones? Um, definitely. I, I can't, there, there isn't anything I could compare to what this was. One, because I had to step into something uh, prior to the movie starting, be a, a new person uh, amongst a group of men who also were all new. And as we then stepped up together to face this and go through it, um, we just, you know, became that group. And sorry, my, my train of thought is slightly off. That's so, okay. so um, uh, but in fact, it's not so much that it, that it was just physically challenging. It was the focus and the commitment that was the challenge. Plus, yeah, the physical. Did you? I know you've been working out right from striptease. That was very everyone. You were talking about that. Did you keep your regiment? Did you step it up for this too? It was just different. I mean, for me, the, this was about being, being, uh, maintaining uh, the reality, and so that I looked capable of doing whatever was being asked of me in the film, and and the best way to do that is just by doing what they had to do, and um, whether it was just what we were being mm -hmm. put through. Or, and as well as the time that they spend, you know, in a gym. There's one question I do want to ask you. It's kind of off. Have you heard about uh, Hillary Clinton and what she said about Julia Roberts and her cigars? No, no. Oh, you didn't hear about that? No, but oh. I'm always the dork who's kind of out of the touch. That's all right. No, I thought, um, I was wondering, because I noticed you smoke a cigar in this movie, and she, uh, she sees it, she's going to say something, I'm sure. Well, and I was on the cover of Cigar Aficionado. <laughs> Quite happily, but what what is it that she said? Just curious. She just said um, that's a terrible representation or something. I don't remember something. She just bashed it about cigar smoking in the movie. Well, you know. Did you wrap us? God, that was quick. Oh, well, you know. Enjoyed it. Sorry, I was stumbling for you. 